Hi, I'm Dan Waisman with Sport Performance Aviation. We're here with uh, Panther Builder Buddy Henson at the Haller Air Park in Florida. We have the prototype um, rivet squeezer to squeeze spars that we'll be loaning out to people to squeeze the uh, big Dash 6 rivets in the spars. Um, it's a real easy operation. It has a little roller set up in the bottom of it and you use a roller stand on the other end and you can roll around with really easily. It's easy to move. It stands here perfectly. So you just put a row of rivets in. We've already set these couple in the middle. And basically how you use it is you roll it to the rivet you want to set, pull it tight against the stop, then there's a little knob, you turn this uh, adjustment in the back all the way tight, turn the, close the valve on the pump, and then give it about six pumps. That was five, but, uh, and uh, loosen the little adjustment, and that's as easy as a set of rivet. Front pulled tight against it, run the, uh, back into it and then one, two, three, four, five, and about six and you're done. Perfect rivet every time. Uh, it's also adjustable for height so you can get the rivets in the middle of the spar web. It has a, a pin here that you just put in and uh, it's set up for doing the other rivets. Then you flip the spar over and do the other cap. So these rivets are just for representation. Ribs go here but in the center web uh, on the, uh, the inboard end of the spar there's some in the middle you have to set. But You might want to take pictures of these spars, Rachel, because this is a good example of how to mark up spars. Because this is an awesome example of how people should do it, how we would do it. You know what I mean? Yeah. Paul's over there doing it now, but this is really great. And also leaving the eighth-inch clicas where they go, so you don't rivet those now. It's Spars look really, really, really nice. Thank you. Very, very nice. If you squeeze them when they're not tight against it, it, make, it makes bad things happen. So always make sure they're tight in there, you know, all the way tight against the head because it won't push it tighter for you, you know what I mean? I always go in here and kind of like pull it back against it when I do it. Straight to slide to kind of 